Welcome to my channel, Planning with Maserati. I am going to be doing a setup video in my... Okay, what was that? Yellow planner. That just sounded weird. So before I begin, welcome. Please subscribe. Hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. Give it a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. That would be greatly appreciated. I just heard like a noise and it just freaked me out. That was weird. Okay, so let's begin. This is the, like I said, a yellow. It's like a kind of like a deep yellow here. It looks in the camera, it looks bright, but here it's more like not as bright. So this has already been set up for the Aaron Condren. But what we're going to do is take all these pages out and then work on setting it up again. What is the back of the book? Let's see. Kindness costs nothing. Devotional 2022. Okay, so let's see if we even use this. In the arms of the Father. I did start using it. Okay. So, I'm going to see if I have that devotional. If not, then I'll just start a new devotional. So, we can leave this here, but I just want to show you what it is. It is the little wonton, or what do you call these? I think wonton, right? It's like Chinese food or whatever. Crown jewels, woman owned, and it has the slide pocket. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to slide this notebook in. When we need to use it, we have it. I was kind of hoping it was blank, but here I set it up as kind words cost nothing. Devotional 2022 Bible app U version. Here it just says plan a creative life. Okay. 52. Agenda 52. Let's see if we can get this to... Sit more in frame really quick. Okay, it's a little bit better. Alright, so what are we putting in here? We have the Agenda 52. I just picked that up. 219 was the cost, and it's supposed to be the whole year. As you can see, it was like taped, whatever. I'm just hoping it works. You know, like everything is okay with it. I'm sure it is. The one that has a major problem with planners is Joanne's. And it's in a good neighborhood. It's not a bad neighborhood. Um, and I don't understand it. Like, how ghetto can you be to destroy? I mean, when I'm talking destroy a planner. Like, if you didn't want it, why would you do it? Like that. Like, this looks bad as it is. Like, look at the pages. This looks bad. Like, it's never been in a carton. Um, it just looks terrible. But for the price, $21.99 to $2.19, I'm going to deal with it. Because why? That's that's a steal. Regular price, $21.99. So think about 50% off. That's still like $11. Like $11.50. And if you're paying regular price, it's $21.99. I'm paying $2.19 for an undated planner. That is a steal. So let's go ahead and have a garbage can sitting right next to me so I don't have to, you know, worry about garbage or anything like that. Okay, so let's get this part out. It is undated because I just took a sneak peek just now. <laughs> Not meaning to. So, 12-month planner, non-dated, 5.75 by 8.25 inch. So, it's an A5 size, the paper studio. And these are the dividers. Now, I wished it didn't have as much color, but for, again, for $2.19, make it work for you. 12-month insert includes... 12-month tab dividers, monthly and weekly calendar pages, room to customize and organize. Okay. We'll see all about that, right? 
We're going to flip it because I like flipping it so that I can work from the back to the front. I don't know about you. Um, how do you like doing your divider? Your divider, your setup. So this is a setup video. Here is December. I love, 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 love the divider. I do have to say that. And it is front and back. The monthly is not on here. Which is awesome because Happy Planner puts the monthly right directly onto that. Or there's another company that does that. And they'll put it right on there. So we're just going to put it like this for a second. I'm going to do it from back to front like I said. So you have your no pages. Well, your no page. It's a very pretty pink. That's what the divider looks like. Divider. I have no sleep, so don't mind me. This is what your monthly... I was ready. This is weekly. This is what your weekly looks like. So if you put it together, that's exactly what it looks like. It's gorgeous. So it starts on a Monday, which I love. Ends on a Sunday. The weekend are not separate. Like, they're not together. They're separated. Maserati needs sleep. So you're going to see, you're going to get the no color, you know, for the notes color, which is pretty. I could use peach or whatever. Pick a color from here with the floral. Okay, so that is the weekly. I should have probably started from the front. I'm going to close it and start from the front. It makes it easier. <clears throat> so again, that's the weekly. So you can see everything is pretty much the same. And then here's your monthly. Give me one second. I need to get sleep. I've been in so much pain underneath your, like, not to be graphic, your right breast. Oh my god, it's in so much pain. So, Sunday start, Saturday end, and then to do's. It's not too bad because you have plenty of color to pick from. So let's close it and then reopen it. Oh, let me show you the page here. I can show you this page. So the December notes this month, special occasions, birthdays, and then whatever notes you're going to take. I like it. So what I'm going to do is this going to be like something for, like when I go to the doctor, I have to write lists of, you know, what's going on with me, what my blood pressure is, um, everything. It's just everything. I've been going through a lot with my health this year, and especially now, it's been worse. And I know worse is not something you're supposed to say, but it has been very, very bad. Like, very, 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 very bad. So the next one is Hello, This Planner Belongs To. And you get a note, and it's lovely, the cardstock. Before we put that, I do want to put my first divider. My sticky notes are not staying today. There we go. Let me fix this one real quick. So you can tell these are like old. I use, I'm shopping my stash. And this is one of the new ones I bought for $2. Okay, so we're going to do this. Let's move this. I don't know why I'm so unorganized today. Okay, so we're going to move this one and put this one on top, just so you can see. Like, if I were to move this out of the way, that's what it would look like. But I'm not looking for pretty. I'm just looking for the dashboard to be first. So this one to be first. And then the hello page. Where do you write your name? Because it says this planner belongs to, I guess, on the bottom and then you have your note pages. Okay. So the next one is going to be January. Be fearless. Fearless should have been a word that I used for my year, but I put self control because I need self control. So fearless. And let me tell you, the other day I had a lot of self control. I like the back as well. And then 
here is the special occasions this month birthdays notes i will be using every part of this you know planner i'm tired of wasting i am seriously just tired of wasting like i have planners for 2023 already dated and can i find it no we packed we had a pack because we asked for heat and she's like you're gonna have to leave and then she's like, well, you could stay until your lease is up. So we moved to my daughter and then came back. And it's been crazy. So you've seen this. So I'm just putting it in there. And I don't know why I'm putting it so slow like this. And then the notes are going to stay the same. So we have December. We have January. Great. Okay, so now I'm just going to do February. I'm going to put it in here. And then show it to you as I go. Here's February, and then the back. So that's basically all you need to see as far as that is concerned. Okay, so where is, oh, I was going to say, where is the rest of the pages? And here's the rest, and then the notes. That one scared me, but we do have it. Okay, so I'm just going to show you the dividers now because it makes more sense. We have April. I mean, not April. I'm already ahead of myself. We have March. Today is a great day to have a great day, which is true. Love the back. And then, as you can see, this is not changing at all. Let's do April. You know what it is? Is when I'm looking for the month, the rest of the months are scattered. I'm going to try to get as much as I can on here. Or in here, not on here. Love that. I like uh, simple, but then I like decoration. I love they did the same thing for the front and back. And I think they did this one the same as well. Yeah. So I like when they do the front and back the same. When it comes to the quotes, I do understand, you know, you don't want the same quote twice. Find joy. I think in like every month in here, I can find a word to use for scripture writing. One is joy. That is super pretty. Oh, I'm glad I picked this one. Because I kept asking him like, which one do you think I should grab? And he's like, this one. And I had four. I was going to do four. So it would have been like $8 and some change. And then with taxes. And I'm thinking about it. I'm like, I need paper for my happy planner. I don't need all four. And then I'm like kicking myself in the butt. I should have at least got two. Not a fan of this one. I don't know why. It's just giving me weird. Like, it's weird. Okay, that was June. My mother's month <clears throat> for her birthday. Life is sweet. Like that. I don't know how much I like the pineapple with all that flowers, but I do like that. But then, this is okay. I'm not a fan of confetti like that. All oh, the skin, chunky by the minute. Now, this one, I really love. <laughs> Look how cute that is. Oh, it's so adorable. And then these are all the same. None of this is going to change. That's why I'm not going to show it to you. Because it's not going to change. Each week has its same color. Same everything. Okay. So then we're in. That was. Did I even tell you the month of that one? August. Okay. Here is September. Good things ahead. Let's see the divider in the back. That's pretty. I like that one. I like it when it's not too full of, you know, the pattern. But like this kind of pattern, I like. I don't I don't understand it. So that was September. Now see this, I'm not too a fan. I'm not a fan of it. it's too much. And they did both sides. Oh my gosh.
But thank God, you know, you can change your dividers out. You can make your own dividers by, you know, customizing it. That was October. So here is November. I'm like, oh my God, where's December? Okay, so it says thankful. Let me put it in. I love that because it is the month for thankful. And in the back, it's just floral. Okay, so we have that. Let's see how chunky with adding in this. It's not too bad. Let's see. And did I say this is a gender 52? So it's not too bad. The only thing is I need is something to hold down the paper. So like how I have the top divider, I need one for the back. Okay. So the next thing is I wanted to put before here. I don't know if I want to use all of them. This one was $1.24. I've had it for so long. And it's a weekly, you know, like you can do a weekly task. And I figured this here was shopping my stash. This is supposed to be $4.99 for $1.24. You can hear how old it is. It's a list pad. And in the back, it has notes. And in the front, just write down your daily tasks. I think I may be here. We'll see. We'll see if it clicks onto anything. Okay, that's right. What is going on? It's Agenda 52. You should fit. I don't know what is with their whole bunch. It's fitting on that side, and then it's, like, not fitting quietly. Quietly. That's right. The words. Okay, there we go. For some reason, the hole punches are kind of off for the way they did that. But we have more trash. Alright, so this is the Life Planner from Erin Condren. I may leave this in here because it's just, like it says, Life Planner of June 2022. But the, what I need out of here is I can use this page, white out the like that. This is 2022, but on the back of it is the whole 2023. So this planner did not come with that. Hopefully this moves. Because I don't know why it's, like, stuck. Okay, so before we go into here... Oh, actually... Yeah, before we go into here, I'm going to put it. I may end up changing it, to be honest with you. And I did put a divider. I should use this one for the back. I probably have more, not to lie. Alright, so the next one is... Okay, so these months are... I can use them later. No, maybe not that one. Definitely not these. Okay, so you can see I planned in it. I did a little bit of planning, but not much. A prayer for moms on Mother's Day. I'm going to put that in the November one. I mean, the June one, I think it is. June or May. It's like all these pages are wasteful. And all I have to do is change the date. So I am going to take the May. Any pages I can take, I'm going to take. Alright, so the 16th. And again, I'm going to wipe this out, put a sticker, and I have a to-do. And then notes on the back. And then here is the same way. So there's a couple of those. I had a bunch of these. Like This is seriously sad. I wasted so much. Here's another divider. Here's some June ones. Okay. 
And then we have some to do's. We could use that, the weather, and then some new pages. And that's it. Let's get this going. All right, so we have all of this. We're going to see if we could put in. If not, it's... every time I look at my desk, I think the contact paper is done. And then anything else, it's going to fall. But there's still like maybe two inches on there, which is kind of ridiculous. So since I didn't use these planners the way they should have been, we are going to add to it. So we're going to look for May. See when, oh, we're not going to know when Mother's Day is. So I'll just put it in the back of May. So maybe May, June. I do want to add that. This is a prayer for mothers. And then I'm going to add this one. And those are the daily sheets. So if I need time slots, change that, sticker that, and do the same for the bag. Okay. I have so many sheets like in here that I didn't use. Yeah, that's good. I'm just checking. Sorry, video is so long. In the back here, we're going to put... Yes, now I'm starting to like click it. Do it myself. Okay, so we're going to put one of these. Some no pages. And I have tons. I have tons of this stuff. Um, we're going to put our to-dos because that's the whole month. There. So we're going to put our to-dos. Put my little... Pineapple. This is, I think, Agenda 52, too. This is Recollections. So old. And then this one is more of me. Yeah, more of me. I thought I pulled some from June, but I guess it's all May. And then in the six-month divider... I'm going to do this for the six months and finish this off here. Because there's two of the same. That's why I had two of the life planners. And there you have it. So we have a little bit of air encounter. And we have... See, this is where I get worried. Yeah, so let me move this. Because this will make me worried. Why it's not hole punched correctly is beyond me. And now for me to find my hole punch, I'd be here for days. Okay, so we're going to leave this where it's at. Put this one here. See, everything else fits, like, perfectly. It's this thing. The holes are not accurate. And I don't think I have a hole punch in front of me. I did. Where's it at? <laughs> That's what I like to know. Okay, so let's squeeze this one in. There we go. It's not too bad, but I don't know what's going on with it. But there is my setup video. I need to start working in it because January 1st will be soon. I need to start dating my planner. So that'll be the next video. You see me dating January, setting up January. And then taking it from there. So I need to get paper or a notebook for here. Are we kidding me? This is going to be a project to move this. Okay, there we go. Maybe it'll open itself up. So I need to get like a little notebook here so I can track my blood pressure. And last, and then get some stick, like little ephemera right there so thank you for watching sorry to shake it's me shaking the camera as i'm talking i'm moving the desk moving stuff thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed the video um i do want to make a reading planner but i don't know because i have so many planners so thank you for watching
I keep saying it, but I do want to thank you. And I will talk to you in the next video. The next one should be me. I have my scripture writing going up for day 27. Today is the 28th. I am going to be doing the 28th scripture writing in a minute. I was thinking kind of like a faith on the go, but then I need a planner where I can say, hey, my appointments are due. Because today I didn't know what I had, what my point appointments are. I need a dedicated planner just for that. And like a little to-do list. And it is an A5, so it is a little bit of a chunky guy. It's still doing that with the pages. See that? But again, thank you for watching. I'll talk to you in the next video, and I will start getting ready for the scripture writing. Have a good one. Bye-bye.